try to envision what would not work anymore if all mainframes would be switched off right now. Good luck with internet banking, good luck with credit card transactions, try to book a plane ticket. So all these kind of things would not work anymore. So I believe that uh, also customers see this kind of strength of the platform and will continue to invest and grow the platform in their businesses. That's what I think we're all working for. ZOS will uh, continue to remain the platform upon which the Internet of Things relies upon, the platform of big data and analytics, and where data scientists analyze their data lake. It's very reliable and, uh, you know, companies like IBM and Rocket, they back this platform, so uh, people, people trust it. The most critical data, the most critical information still resides on the mainframes today. And it's still on the Z platform, primarily on the Z platform, especially if you go into the finance sector or you go into the insurance sector or you go into banking or retail. ZOS as an operating system and the mainframe as a machine power some of the most uh, high performance, highest, um, highest importance industries and machines in, in the industry. It's, it's always going to be there and you know our job is to make the data that's there as accessible as possible and in as easy as possible way. It's frankly a lot easier and a lot more interesting and a lot more sustainable long term to adapt ZOS to the interfaces of today, the interactions of today, the people of today and bringing ZOS into modern life more than trying to shoehorn new developers into old software. What we try to do is come up with the easiest ways to do that, especially with all the legacy systems that are there, with all the legacy data that's there, and make it all accessible via the modern uh, mechanisms that we're all you know, completely comfortable with, with our mobile phones and the apps and everything that we use. So. In terms of the performance, the throughput, it's really designed for transactions and storage. So the mainframe is cloud ready in terms of its performance. All the open source that is available on distributed, all the tooling is available on Z as well. And not only that, you can do machine learning, you can do artificial intelligence, you can do blockchain. It's just morphed over time to accommodate a more flexible provisioning scheme so that users can um, allocate what they need on ZOS. So ZOS is still very modern, it's still very relevant, um, and even though it sort of has behaved as a cloud platform, it's just getting more flexible as um, market demands in the future. We're trying to bring more modern stuff to the mainframe, modern tools and you know, languages. Give it a chance and you will really enjoy it. All the modern interfaces, all the modern experience exists on Z as it exists on distributed.